inviting second and third level connections is essential to expanding your network on LinkedIn. This action will automatically click connect button, insert a personalized connection request and send it to a group of profiles you'll choose. Let's look in more detail at how this action works. First, begin by creating a new campaign. Click Add Action and insert Invite Second and Third Level Connections. Next, proceed to setting up the message template. Start typing your invitation text, injecting variables to make it personal. In the preview section, try pasting variable values to see what the message will look like for different recipients. Click Save and Close. In its basic form, the action is almost set up. Now you need to add profiles for processing. Choose from a variety of sources. Most people turn to LinkedIn search page. It requires no paid subscription to begin. Search for your audience using keywords like a job title or a skill. Make sure to apply connections filter, select second and third level. Additionally, you may apply different filters that you can find under all filters. When your search is ready, click on the funnel icon next to queue and select from current page. Allow Linked Helper a few minutes to go through search results and pull these profiles into queue. Or you can stop collecting when you think you have enough profiles for processing. These profiles are now in your campaign queue. If you want to remove some of them, install the Exclude List plugin. Go to the plugin store, switch to Campaigns, find and install Exclude List. Then go back to your campaign, select profiles you'd like to remove and click on this icon. Let's start the campaign. Linked Helper picks the first profile from queue, tracks it down using the search field, finds the connect button, and inserts a personalized connection request. You will find successfully invited profiles in the successful sublist with the messages they received and processing times. Click on the name and you will be taken to the CRM record with the full messaging history and campaigns history. If Linked Helper never fully opened that page, you will see some limited profile data. For some profiles, when Linked Helper had to load the page fully to find the connect button, all profile data will be scraped. Now let's look at how we can enhance this action with plugins. In More Plugins at the bottom of this page, find and activate Advanced Settings for the Invite Second and Third Level Connections actions. 
This has numerous options specifically for the inviting action. Check Save as Lead checkbox. This usually appears when inviting via Sales Navigator. Linked Helper will not forget to check Save as Lead and you will see such profiles as saved. Second option, in case email is required, add it from custom variable. Some profiles cannot be invited without knowing their email. If you know emails of such profiles, you can create them as a custom field in Linked Helper interface. For this, you will need to open this profile in the CRM, scroll down to Custom Variables, create a field title, and a field value, which is email, and click on the plus. This will create a custom field for this profile. Don't forget to specify the field title. Two more options below allow you to pick emails from other databases. Email Finder tool is an internal Linked Helper database. Snowvio is a third-party email finder tool. You need to set up an account with them. Then under All Integrations, connect Linked Helper to Snowvio. There is a detailed guide on how to do it. Now let's look at some more actions and settings. First of all, Linked Helper enables you to bypass the weekly invite limit from LinkedIn. If you leave this setting at wait until next week, we will freeze this action if you run into a limit until next week. If you switch to LinkedIn undocumented feature, invitations will continue despite the limit. Under Available Optional Plugins, activate Postpone Action Start. This plugin allows you to pick a date and time in future when your campaign will begin. If you start a delayed action, it will turn into a sleep mode and is due to resume on a scheduled date and hour. Override Platform plugin allows you to choose the platform for processing profiles. In this campaign, I have profiles collected from the Sales Navigator. By default, Linked Helper will process them on Sales Navigator. To change that, in the drop-down menu of the Override Platform plugin, select LinkedIn. Take a look how a new platform has been assigned for processing. Switching platforms may be useful to keep all messaging history in one place or in case you have email credits on a certain platform but you've imported contacts from another source. Scroll down to More Plugins below. Tagging System This plugin allows you to automatically assign or remove tags from successfully processed profiles. Start typing your tag, then click Create Tag or press Enter key. One profile in my queue has got the demo tag. I'm expecting it to be removed and the profile to receive three new tags after processing.
Action Step Delays. This plugin allows you to control wait times and timeouts in processing bunches of profiles and individual profiles. Normally, default settings are good to go, but you can set preferences. For example, make Linkit Helper sleep for 60 minutes after processing each 15 profiles. The text input method means that connection request could be inserted like this, typed, imitating your human typing method, or randomly alternate between both. Delay presets define micro pauses between steps in processing a single profile. You can stick with the default fast delays, which are safe, or if you want to go slower, switch to safe delays, which are longer. Or you can manually set your preferences. For example, let's reduce the wait time before we click the connect button to maximum of 30 seconds. Action working hours. This plugin allows you to set a weekly schedule for processing your connection requests. Click on the edit icon, select your time zone, and set the time intervals for each single day. Or mark certain days as non-working. Congratulations, you are now fully armed with a great tool to automatically expand your network on LinkedIn.